Welcome back. Now we'll take your questions. If you have a question yourself, send it to us at QuranSpeaks.com. So Dr. Shapir, the question today is about guilt. And what, what does one do uh, when they have guilt over a major sin? How do you deal with that? I think the first thing is to be aware that, that God is forgiving and merciful, and uh, one should not lose hope over the mercy of God. If you have guilt over a major sin, you can feel overwhelmed and think, okay, God is not going to forgive me, I'm doomed. And um, our scholars um, uh, describe this situation as one of the tricks of the devil. Uh, the devil wants you to despair so that you might conclude, okay, I'm going to hell anyway, so I may as well enjoy the rest of my life by committing more, more sins. sins yeah. <laughs> um, so uh, the, uh, do not despair. Uh, know that God is ready, ready to forgive. The Quran actually promises this. Uh, and the uh, Quran says, La tay asu mir ro, uh, mir rahmatillah. Do not uh, despair over the mercy of God. And uh, la taqnatu mir, mir rahmatillah. Do not, um, uh, uh, again, do not despair. A different way of saying the same thing uh, over the mercy of God. And then the Quran promises, In Allah yaghfiru dhunuba jami'ah. God forgives all sins. And um, uh, God speaks actually um, in a kind way regarding this. It says, uh, say to my servants uh, who have wronged themselves that uh, they should not despair over the mercy of God. So how do you deal with the actual guilt? So knowing that, yes, I shouldn't despair, I shouldn't lose hope, but you just have so much guilt that, for example, uh, you know, when you're, when you're praying um, or just seeking forgiveness, you just, you just keep reminding yourself unconsciously, right, that that's or consciously rather that you, you have this big burden. How yeah. do you deal so with that? So what what we do is we ask God for forgiveness. Um, you know, telling somebody uh, about your your sin can help you to get it off your chest, and 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 this is perhaps why we have confessions in some other faiths. But in our faith, we we don't confess to anyone else. We only confess to God. So yeah, confess to God. Say God, I'm really sorry. I messed up that time. Please, uh, you know, help me to overcome this. And uh, I want to do what is good from now on. So you repent. You repent repair what is wrong. If you've harmed somebody, you repair that harm to the best of your ability and you move on with it. Thank you very much, Dr. Rear. You're welcome. Hey YouTube, we hope you benefited from this video. If you liked it, or if you didn't, let us know in the comments below. And if you're interested in learning more, check out some of our other videos. And don't forget to subscribe so you can get new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday.